Photo editing is an important step of the photography process. Without it, your photos lack the zing it takes to stand out online. Sometimes the editing process can get tedious, especially without having an end goal in mind. With that being said, in this video, we provide you with a photo editing checklist that will help you edit photos like a pro. Welcome to Vigot Media. We are a multimedia agency that offers professional services and training in all areas of digital media such as graphic design, video production, audio production, and digital marketing. This channel is dedicated in providing free informational tips and easy tutorials on how to make digital content using various software in the digital media space. Before we head to the checklist, let's take a look at some of the things that can impact photo editing. 1. A bad photo shoot. This happens when you are not prepared for the shoot. Planning for the shoot is the most important step because it keeps you well prepared ahead of time. Check out our photo shoot checklist to effectively plan for a photo shoot. 2. Monitors. A dimly lit monitor can impact your editing without you knowing it. It leads to imperfect adjustments in the photo. The best thing to do is increase the brightness of your screen. 3. Software. There is a plethora of photo editing software out there. Choose one that would suit your needs and learn to use it well to make the best of the software. 4. Not enabling autosave. This is crucial. If you don't have autosave enabled, then the editing you make on a photo won't be saved. If your software or system crashes, then you will lose the adjustments made. Another important thing to do here is to have a backup of your project files. Now that we saw what could potentially impact photo editing, let's dive into the photo editing checklist. Number 1. Device and Software Make sure you use a good PC or laptop that has a well-lit screen and also the capability to support editing software. Using professional photo editing software like Adobe Photoshop, Lightroom, Affinity Photo Cyberlink Photo Director 365, etc. will help you get the best out of your editing. There are much more softwares out there and even AI photo editing tools. Check out our video on AI photo editing tools to make your editing process seamless. Number 2. Import the photo. First things first, open your software, set up a project file, make sure autosave is enabled, and then upload your image for editing. Number 3. Lens correction and cropping. Lens correction allows for fixing lens problems such as chromatic aberration. Use cropping to crop edges or areas that may not be significant with the photo presentation at its full length. Number 4. Retouching elements in the photo. Retouching is the polishing of a photo. It helps remove spots, impurities, and any other imperfections visible in photographs. Number 5. Making adjustments in the photo. This mainly twigs to tweak the photo's look by adjusting the brightness, contrast, saturation, exposure, white balance, sharpness, and more. You can also make color corrections to the photo. Number 6. Using histogram. The histogram is a level adjustment layer where you can modify the strength and tones of colors. Though it works over colors, it is independent of the color correction for the characteristics. It gives life to the colors in your photo. Number 7. Using filters. Add some effects if you think of doing it useful for your product images. Well, this is an additional option that you may like to use or may not. However, the addition of effects can reduce your labor if you have the proper knowledge. Most of the product photos do not need the effect to add over it. But, it may be appealing sometimes if you can do it properly with the correct adjustments. Think of using filters as color grading. Number 8. Export. After doing all the modifications mentioned above, it is time to export the photos to your required format. Most of the time, Photos are saved as JPEG, but depending upon your need, there are other formats that you can export in. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel for more informational videos related to the media industry. See you in the next video.